Hello all, welcome to Selenium Python training series. In this session, as part of PyTest, I am going to explain and practically demonstrate how to attach screenshots in the generated Allure reports. So let's get started. In the previous session, I have shown you how to generate Allure reports. Now in this session, I'm going to show you how to attach screenshots in the generated Allure report. So let's get started with the practical demonstration. And here is the code we have to write that I will demonstrate in this practical demonstration. First, I'll switch to this PyCharm ID. Uh, let's say I would like to run this uh, test methods which are there in this test search.py file. I don't want to run all the tests because it will take a lot of time. There are total seven tests that I have created in the previous session. If I keep running them, it will take a lot of time. Rather, if I run this uh, test search.py file, it has only three tests. It will not take much time. So in one of the tests, I would like to take a screenshot. Okay, in one of the tests that is shown here, I would like to take a screenshot. So wherever you want to take a screenshot, you write this line. Okay, generally in real time, we take the screenshot for the failed test, but here I'm not going with that approach. Rather, I would like to take the screenshot, whether the test passes or fails, fails doesn't matter. I would like to take a screenshot. So wherever you want to take a uh, screenshot, whatever the situation may be, you just have to write this line. That is, you have to write allure dot. When you say allure dot, you are getting an error. Hover the mouse on this allure and import this allure. You'll get this import allure added. And after that, you write down dot attach. Now in the circular brackets, now write the code for taking the screenshot. Generally in Selenium, as I covered in the previous sessions, right somewhere here in Selenium web driver, how to take the screenshots I covered, right? So let's take screenshot uh, of a, you see, taking screenshots using get screenshot as file, okay? Get screenshot as file or whatever, as PNG. A lot of commands are there, okay? A lot of commands are there, how to take the screenshots and all. So here, save screenshot is there and we can give the name and all. Uh, as file, we can say, as PNG, we can say. Many, many varieties are there. I'll go with one variety in this session. So get screenshot as kind of thing I'll use, okay? So I'll write down here, driver dot, but uh, this driver, you see, wherever you are writing driver, you are using the self keyword, right? As I covered in the previous session, because these methods are part of this uh, class. So, so we have to provide self and uh, all these things uh, that are being passed from somewhere else need to be starting with uh, self. Self dot driver, you have to say. So just follow the previous session to understand why we are using self before this driver. Self dot driver dot. Here I have to write get screenshot as PNG out. Okay. So it will take the screenshot. This command will take the screenshot in PNG format. Now say comma. And the next thing is you have to give the name for the screenshot file. So name is equal to second and three attributes we have to give. This is the first attribute. This is the first thing. The code for taking the screenshot in the PNG format. Name is equal to give the name of that uh, screenshot file. Let's say I would like to take the screenshot with the name. This is search without providing any product, right? I'll give the same name. Copy this and give that here. This is the name of the screenshot file. And the last one is the last one is the type of attachment type. Okay. In which type of attachment I have to attach in the allure reports? It should be in PNG format like that. Okay. I'll simply say attachment type is equal to this is the third attribute is equal to here I have to say attachment type and this attachment type I have to import from Allure library and after that I have to say attachment type dot png I have to give so this line you have to write so this is becoming becoming lengthy that's okay it's okay to become lengthy. This is a thing, okay? This is a line. You can see that here, the code uh, that I have written here, you can see that here. The Let me close all this stuff and uh, that's all. And uh, let me go to this location of PyTest. This is the thing, allure.attach. The first uh, argument is self.driver.get screenshot as PNG. Second argument is name is equal to, you give some name that you want uh, the screenshot name to be. And third one should be attachment type. Attachment underscore type is equal to attachment type dot png. Okay, this this code you have to write wherever you want to take a screenshot and attach that to the new reports. Okay, not just we are not just taking the screenshot by using this code, but rather we are attaching the screenshot, taking screenshot to the new report by writing this line, this piece of code. Okay, by writing this piece of code, we are attaching the screenshot to the new report. 
So only in the third test, we have written this line means only in the third test, the screenshot will be attached to the report. For the remaining two tests uh, which you are running, no screenshot will be attached. That we'll see anyhow. Now let's run this. So let's uh, run this test and also generate the new reports. For that, I'll go to the terminal. Here I'll type my test. I don't want to run all the Python files in this project. Rather, I would like to run only this uh, test search.py file, which is under the test package under this package. Uh, under this project, I'll write the package name test slash and name of the file test search dot py file space now give hyphen hyphen allure dir i covered this in the previous session how to generate the allure report i covered in the previous allure dir is equal to give the location here there is no reports folder under this project i want to create a reports folder just name mention the name of the folder dot slash reports so this reports folder will be dynamically created by this command itself okay this line see out right okay this code here this command you have to run right test 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 search dot py allure dir is equal to dot slash reports. Now press enter. So three tests will run. You see only three tests are running because I am specially running test uh, search dot py file just to save time. Three search tests will run. In first two search tests, no screenshot will be taken in the, but in the third one, the screenshot will be taken. Third test of the search py file, the screenshot will be taken. First is done, no screenshot is taken. No screenshot will be taken in the first test. Second test also no screenshot will be taken. So the second test is running now. No screenshot will be taken. Now third test in the third test screenshot will be taken. Okay, because we have included that line allu dot attach and all those stuff. The screenshot will be taken and not only taken but also should be attached to the allu report. So in this test the screenshot will be taken. Fine, the screenshot has been taken. How can I confirm that screenshot has been taken? You see, as I mentioned in this command, a reports folder should be created. You see the reports folder got created here. I will expand the reports folder. You see the JSON files are there. Not only the JSON files, wherever the screenshot has been taken, a PNG file is also there. You see, this is a screenshot file. You can see that screenshot if you want. Open in Explorer, go to the location where the, you see this is a screenshot file. Open this. This is a screenshot, okay, the, it will load. You see, this is a screenshot that has been taken. Now let's confirm whether this particular screenshot will be attached to the uh, allure report or not. For that, I uh, have to run one more command, right? This JSON files will be created, but uh, I want to generate allure HTML report as I covered in the previous session to generate the, uh, finally, with the help of this JSON files, how to generate the allure HTML report, right click on this project, say open in Explorer, go to the location of the project and oh, go inside the project. Once you go inside the project, select this project path and type CMD. Come, Windows command prompt will open at that project location, this project location. And here you have to type allure space serve space, the location where the JSON uh, reports are there. Okay. Dot slash reports. The, under the reports folder, we have that JSON files and that uh, PNG file. Okay. The screenshot file that need to be attached in the report. That location we have to give and press enter. That's it. Now, in a while, it will generate the allure report which contains the results of the three tests in the search functionality. You see, it is opening the report, a new report, where you can see three test cases, which got everything got passed. Now click on this. Under the test search, we have run the test search and uh, three tests got run. In the first test, you see there is no report, no screenshot, sorry. There's no screenshot in the first uh, test because we have not added that line, screenshot taking line. The second uh, test also no screenshot is there. But in the third test, apart from the setup, and here down, you got one test body thing having the screenshot here. You can expand this. You see, you can see the screenshot here with the given name search without providing any product with extension PNG. The screenshot has been created. You can click on this to expand and see from the report. Okay, this is a screenshot that has been taken and attached to the Allu reports. So, hope you understood how to attach screenshots in Allu reports in this session. So, that's all for this session. Thank you. Bye bye.